Hello everybody, it is me, Mr. Vince, and I hope you all have an amazing day today. And we got some extremely good news from Roblox today. That's right guys, Roblox is dramatically improving the anti-cheat, which means jailbreak is more safe now. In this video, I'm going to talk about some extra information regarding Roblox's anti-cheat. So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into the video. Now I will leave a link to the roadmap in the description. That is the webpage I used to view the brand new anti-cheat improvements. So I'm going to specifically read only one category and that category is balanced safety and moderation. And by the way, if you want to find that, it is part of week three of the roadmap so if you read week three of the roadmap, you'll be able to find the balance, safety, and moderation category. I will only read that because a lot of people talked about it. So let's get right into it. Our safety features, tools, and moderation capabilities have been built into the design of our product. We are continuing to work to make those capabilities smarter and stronger over time and we'll be investing more heavily in the detection and prevention of inexperienced exploits. Yeah, I can't believe Roblox is finally doing this. We already got the release of Bifron a few weeks ago, but it seems like the anti-cheat is still improving by Roblox, which is insane. So the first one is pretty important to a lot of people, but this one says moderation precision. We are working hard to lessen the burden of asset moderation while keeping the community safe. And this one is ongoing, which means it is still going on today and it's still being improved, which means this might be complete within a few weeks, which is not that bad, to be honest. I mean, moderation really needed to be improved, so that's good. I mean, if you just upload like a shirt of SpongeBob's shirt, then you shouldn't get a warning or a ban so hopefully moderation precision improves and works better all right so the next two are very essential and a lot of people are extremely happy and i know some of you are going to be a little bit disappointed but i will start with probably one of the biggest ones anti-cheat improving client side and server side anti-cheat and giving you more ways to identify and block cheaters using Bifron's technology, coming out in mid-2023. This one is insanely big. I mean, this is one of the most important ones in this video. I mean, to be honest, so many people like me have suffered from the worst of the worst, particularly exploiters, and those exploiters would ruin the fun of many games, especially jailbreak. Anti-cheat is still improving. Even Asimo was so happy about it. I mean, you can definitely tell Asimo is so excited to be done with jailbreak's anti-cheat because at this point, he's probably like, yeah, I'm done with the anti-cheat. We need this to release so we can just improve our anti-cheat. That's probably Asimo right now. But with that being said, this is something that we have all been waiting for. Well, except for a couple of us. But with that being said, it is releasing as part of mid-2023, so it could release in June, July, or August. But this is still very, very big and essential. Alt Account Detection. Take action on repeat offenders and help us combat exploiters on Roblox. You can't make alt accounts if you keep repeating the same bans on Roblox. So that's good. But some people are a little bit worried as to how you can make an actual alt account and use it by yourself without exploiting, of course. Well, Roblox is gonna know and will take action against it. But now it's time to talk about one other thing, relaxed text filter. Optionally adjust rules for experiences that are rated 13 plus. These last two are releasing as part of late 2023 and text filter is another essential one 
I mean, it depends on the age group, but for the most part, this one is going to completely change how Roblox would work. I mean, if you're part of an older age group, then obviously you're going to see some differences with the text filter. So I don't think Jailbreak is going to change its text filter because basically everyone, regardless of age group, would just play Jailbreak. I mean, it really doesn't matter. The text filter should just probably stay the same. And we don't want to see too many toxic people, am I right? We just can't see someone say some bad sailor talk, all right? But with that being said, these four are coming out this year. Thankfully, because otherwise we will have to wait till like 2024 or 2025 to get these things. Moderation Precision, as far as I know, is the only one that is still ongoing. The rest of them will not release until sometime later this year. So what do you guys think? Do you think these are very essential and very good? Please feel free to let me know down in the comments. But anyway, that is all I got for this video. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. And if you have enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like. And if you're new to the channel, please feel free to subscribe as well. But as always, my name is Mr. Vince. I hope you all have an amazing day today. And I'll see you guys in the next video.